And with many of us anxious to get back to some normalcy, there's a controversy surrounding proof of vaccination. Republican lawmakers want to prevent businesses from requiring people to show proof that they have received the COVID-19 vaccine. CBS 58's Emily Fannin is live in Madison with the GOP push to ban vaccination certificates. Emily. With the Biden administration exploring the idea of so-called vaccine passports, Republicans are trying to get ahead of the initiative. They believe it should be left up to someone's decision whether or not they want to get the vaccine, and that shouldn't prevent them if they want to go to a concert or a sporting event. As we inch closer to a post-pandemic world, Republican lawmakers are introducing proposals to prevent discrimination based on whether you got the COVID-19 vaccine. A series of GOP bills would prevent companies and the Evers administration from requiring so-called vaccine passports to enter a business, state building, or a sporting event. They don't need government telling them that they have to do X just so that they can end up attending a Packer game. The concept of a vaccine passport is to reduce the anxiety around things we did pre-pandemic, like going to a concert without fear of getting COVID-19. Wisconsin doesn't currently require a vaccine certificate, but those involved in sporting events say they're not opposed to the idea. And maybe at the end of the day, hopefully it incentivizes some people to get out and, and get vaccinated. Democrats call the GOP bills premature and believe it could discourage people from getting vaccinated. I think that it is really concerning and alarming that the politics of the vaccine are coming before the health and safety of the people here. Republicans argue it's not about casting doubt on vaccines. Instead, they want to protect individual rights. What's not appropriate is basically for a private business or a government to demand a health record from someone these proposals are likely to make it through the Republican-led legislature, but the governor is likely to oppose them. The governor has previously vetoed GOP attempts on other vaccine bills that would prohibit employers from requiring them. In Madison, Emily Fannin, CBS 58 News.